Welcome back to ADHD Whiskey. My name is Matt. The most underrated bourbon on the planet is Knob Creek Single Barrel. Trust me, do it. If you were to go in to any store on the planet that sold bourbon and you look at the cashier and you say, cashier, and they're like, how can I help you? And you're like, shh, shh, I wasn't done talking. You interrupted me. And they're like, I feel like you were, and you're like, stop it, you did it again. And they're like, I'm sorry. And you're like, you bet you should be. And then you say, let me ask you a question. Do you think you are cashiering at an acceptable liquor store? And they would say, yeah, I think so. And then you would say, well, let me check for you. And you walk over to the bourbon section, the American whiskey section, and you peruse their shelf. And you're like, oh, Jack Daniels, J Jim Beam, freaking free. Oh, wait, the Knob Creek, Knob Creek, single barrel. And then you go up to the cashier and you're like, I'll take this. And I'll also take an apology for your attitude. And they'll say, I'm sorry, sir. I didn't know. And you're like, that's all I needed to hear. I'll take this. And you were right. You are an acceptable liquor store. You're not exceptional because an exceptional liquor store would have somebody working the cashier who was polite and caring and at least six foot four with bulging trapezius muscles or five foot four with bulging breastuses. That's how you tell if a liquor store is acceptable or not. They carry Knob Creek Single Barrel. The exceptional stores will have a store pick, a friggin' store pick. That means that that store chose a barrel of Knob Creek and they would range between nine and 15 years old. The regular Knob Creek Single Barrels are nine years old. They're nine years minimum, 120 proof. At $50, that's a friggin' steal. And they're delicious. They're really good. But if the store or, the, or a group picks a barrel from the distillery, from the Jim Beam distillery, they can range 10 years, 11 years, 12 years, 13 years, 14 years, or 15 years. And that's what this is. This was a gift from Dramhound, who is an exceptional human being. It's providing a shite ton of proof. It's providing a shite ton of oak and a shite ton of nuttiness. While I have it here, I want to do a little comparison, a little comparisonion between a 15 year Knob Creek single barrel store pick, a dream barrel they say, versus what I have left of a regular Knob Creek single barrel that's just bottled by Jim Beam Distillery. Same price, they're the same price. I'm sure you nailed it. And it's marked with the letter C because it came from Jim Beam this way. And the 15 year, America, will go in A because it is about 15 years old. That makes sense. Get in there. Get in there, you. Friggin' nailed it. I just wanna compare these. Booker's is like $100 now. Made from the same distillery. It's barrel proof at like 120 some, 127 proof, let's say. Um, 100 bucks. And about six years old. Well, you could buy two Knob Creek single barrels for the same price as one Booker's. And they're only watered down a little bit, down to 120 proof. And they're a minimum of nine years old. A minimum. A minimum. And they're usually older, but a minimum of nine years. Whoa. Wow, it's a poofy gal. Caramel and hot nuts. That's good though. It's definitely good. Not something that you're gonna find elsewhere for $50. Now this one is the 15 year. Can you bounce with me, bounce with me? 
Can you, can you, can you bounce with me, bounce with me? Can I hit it in the morning without giving you half of my dough? And even worse, if I was broke, would you want me? If I couldn't get you finer things like all of them diamond rings, bitches kill foe, would you still roll? If we couldn't see the sun rising over the shore tile in, would you ride then? If I wasn't driving, if I wasn't, oh, uh, hey, figure by the name of Jigga, would you come around me and would you clown me? Couldn't flow futuristic, would you? Put your two lips on my wooden kiss, it, could you? See yourself with a working harder than nine to five? <sighs> I'm about six to not to survive or do you need a baller so you can shop and tear them all up brag to your friends what I bought ya if you couldn't see yourself with a when your dough is low when baby girl if this is so yo can I get a for $50 these are drastically different these are drastically different for $50 you can get the standard single barrel offering from Knob Creek, 120 proof, age dated nine years. An abrasive, in your face, UFC fighter with four ounce gloves beating you until you're unconscious. That's what this is. The 15 year is like being picked apart by a UFC fighter while you're standing, trying to defend yourself but you can do it um he has so much finesse and he sees all the openings and just when you think you're about to hit him he hits you with something you've never seen before a uh, 360 flying crescent kick to the back of your ear and it knocked your equilibrium out of whack and you're like oh i can't even stand up straight that's not the alcohol talking that was a flying 360 degree crescent kick to the back of your ear or maybe it was the alcohol We'll never know, because guess what? You can't remember because you just woke up and then you're in the hospital and your wife was like, you drank too much in Op Creek and you're like, I could have swore I got into a fight with a very good UFC fighter. And she's like, no, you passed out in the living room shooting a whiskey video for the internet and you're not allowed to do that anymore. And you're like, oh shit. <sighs> was that me? That might've been me. If you would like more content, you can join my Patreon page by clicking on the link in the description below. Uh, by supporting the channel, you help me convince my wife to let me do this. I want this to continue. Help me prove to her that this is worthwhile. And every time I get a new patron, I, I get in her face and I'm like, guess what? New friggin' patron. And she's like, oh, good for you, honey. And I'm like, that's damn right it's good for me. Yeah, in your face. And she's like, you don't have to be so aggressive. And I'm like, sorry, I was anticipating a fight about this. And she's like, why? And I'm like, I don't know. Because TV told me to expect it. And TV has never guided me wrong. Except for a couple times. Like Back to the Future. 1.21 gigawatts isn't all that much. I produce that much power with my penis when I plug it in to a vagina. Boom, probably cutting that out. Probably should, probably will. That will probably end up on Patreon actually, cause that's the kind of stuff you get on Patreon. Me talking about how much power my pecker produces and it produces a pecker ton of power. And a pecker ton is at least 1.21 gigawatts. For show, for show. Fire skin, oh my gosh. My name is Matt, this is ADHD Whiskey, and we just talked about how Knob Creek Single Barrel is the friggin' most underrated bourbon on the planet. We also talked about um, how you should become a patron and how you should leave a comment in, in the description below. That's not right. You should leave a comment. You should leave a comment below telling me what I should do better with my life, because that's probably a good thing. Hit the thumbs up, asshole.